पारण करे जी हरे Hare Krishna Mataji, it's Kaushi. Hare Krishna Mataji, it's Kaushi. Hare Krishna kids. Hare Krishna Mataji. I was just thinking Kirtan. <laughs> Mataji, did um Janavi join? I got kicked out because of that. I got kicked out. You got kicked out. Yeah, Janvi is there. Oh, Janavi. Did you make me the host? Uh, so, yeah, Mataji, she came in. I got kicked out because she kicked on, clicked on okay, okay. ongoing progress of the call. So then uh, she uh, came in. I have to drop out. Oh, is it? Okay, Janvi. Okay, get out of that. One second, Mataji, I will give you the... Uh, Thank you, Mataji. Janvi. Yes, Mataji, please take out Mataji. Mataji. Mataji, this is me, Tanvik. Hare Krishna, Tanvik. Mataji, I have some. Can I tell you something? Today is Vijaya Dashami for me and Dashara. Hey, oh, yes. How's it today? I, I'm going to check. My mom got kicked, not kicked out again. <laughs> How's that happening, Vrinda? My mom got um, kicked out. My daddy, it was actually, I didn't, it did not see it on my calendar. Yes. Yeah, is it? Yeah, it, it said it was, it was actually, it was Madhava Chaya's appearance day. Mm -hmm. I don't want to say it in my calendar. Awesome. <clears throat> All right. Let's get started with today's class, actually. All right, kids. Um, welcome to today's um, <clears throat> Davodar class. 
And um, let us get started with today's class. Uh, we got stuff to cover, so sorry. Multitasking kids, sorry. All right, <clears throat> so let's get started. You know the drill. We're gonna start our class with Sri Guru Pranam Mantra is on your screen and uh, followed by Hare Krishna Mahamantra 11 times. <clears throat> and we're gonna do that together. So let's do it. Oh my Yeah, that was beautiful uh, chanting, kids. Amazing. I really like hearing you chanting. It's always, always very beautiful. All right, so let's get into this now. It's story time. And we're going to talk about one of the moral story as we pick every single week. And towards the end of the story, we're going to talk about each other's realization, right? So what we learned from today's story. That's what we're going to talk about. Anthony, how could a cat be a doctor? <laughs> yeah, I know. Surprising, right? Let's find out. All right. Mama, so a doctor. Is it imaginative? Hare Krishna, Mother. Hare Krishna, Mother. Hare Krishna, everybody. All right, let's jump into the story. Hare Krishna, Mother. This is John Vita Lai. Hare Krishna, John Vita Hare Krishna, Mother. Hare Krishna, Mother. This is Balvin and Janvi. Hare Krishna kids. Okay, we gotta just start with the story now, okay? Um, 
So let's understand it this way that even animals need doctor, right? Somebody specialized there. But let's see what this story talks about. So once upon a time, there was a cat. All right, we see the cat right here. And the cat was, one of the times the cat overheard the discussion between some birds. So birds are talking between themselves and the cat overheard their discussion. So one of the bird was saying that our friends who are being kept in that big cage are sick and, they, and their disease is spreading. We should immediately search for a doctor now. Why? Because they're sick, the disease is spreading, everybody's gonna get sick very, very soon. So we need a doctor now. So the, because the cat was overhearing this conversation, she started thinking in her mind that if I go to those birds in the in the disguise, uh, if I'm disguised as a doctor, and if I go to those uh, birds, then I can quickly kill one bird every day and fill my stomach. Now you see why the cat was a doctor? Hmm. So that was the plan the cat had. Okay, so after that, what the cat did is the cat went to a makeup man and then said, Oh, make me look like a doctor. So just change my entire look so that I look like a doctor. Remove my mustache and then make the stripes on my body disappear. So, you know, anybody who looks at me cannot recognize that I'm a cat. They should look at me as a doctor and that's what I wanna be. So make these stripes go away, take my mustache off and then make me look like a doctor. So uh, the makeup artist, he started talking to the cat saying that, I cannot make these stripes on your body disappear. You know, how can I do that with just the makeup um, or, or whatever I have? I can give doctor coat to you with long sleeves so you can hide all your stripes on your arms. Under that, I can give you shoes and long socks, big hat with a scarf. In this way, you can actually, you know, cover all the stripes of your body. I can't conceal that, but you can cover it with all these things which I can give you. Okay, so if you look at the cat, cat started wearing all the costume and whatever, um, the hat and everything that the, the makeup artist is giving and she was extremely happy about that. And she started thinking, good idea that no one will recognize me now. So you see, like she's all covered up now with all my stuff, with the, with the long coat, which usually doctors wear. And that, now with all that wearing, um, and after she wore all that, the makeup artist may a uh, makeup artist man made the cat look like a doctor. The, do you see the hat also has a cross sign on it? So the cat wore the white coat and wore a spectacles as well. So she wore the glasses too. She hung the stethoscope around her neck, which doctors always carry with themselves so that they can check uh, patients anytime and wore the hat of a doctor. So, you know, her whole Appearance has changed now. She looks like a doctor now. So as she is disguised as a doctor, she she was carrying a bag, which usually doctors take with them with all the stuff they need uh, to check any patient. Um, she had that bag as well, and she reached <clears throat> near the cage of those birds uh, where she had to head right because she heard the conversation that the birds in the cage are not well, and that's where she wanted to go. So she reached that cage and she started talking to the birds uh, saying that I'm a doctor and I have come to know that there's disease spreading here and many birds are ill. To treat all of you, I've come here. So can you please open the door so that I, and let me in so that I can check all of you one by one and I can give you the medicine and make things all right, or fix whatever problems we have going on or whatever disease is spreading, I can fix all that. So let me in. When the birds heard that, they were extremely happy because they knew that they are not well. So anybody who's not well is not happy about this situation, right? They, everybody wants to recover from their illness. That's exactly the birds wanted too. So when they heard that, they were very, very happy. They started screaming at the top of their voice. But at the same time, you know, there's always a smart one. So there was a smart and a clever bird there. And that clever bird said, wait, wait, do not open the door so soon. Let's find out who this doctor is. We don't even know that doctor. So we have to know first of all before opening the door to any, any stranger, right? You all know that, right? You would have heard it so many times. 
don't open the door for strangers don't talk to strangers right so yeah it's, it's exactly the same thing so uh the clever birds are talking to the cat saying that please tell me which family you belong to this is just investigating now cat was humbled cat didn't expect this cat thought that she can easily get in there because she's in the right costume they can recognize that she's a cat so you know there's no way they will ask they will question her and not let her in she's like family a doctor i'm a doctor right so she's just stumbling her words are stumbling right now <laughs> but the but the bird says that okay we know that you're a doctor everybody can see that because that's the costume you're wearing but what's your cast just like how we are crows and sparrows and parrots and peacocks and pigeons. Similarly, which class do you belong to, right? So they all are animal and they know that she is an animal too, but what kind of animal are you? Uh, you know, you're a doctor, but what animal are you? That's what they're trying to figure out. So what family you belong to? Hearing this question, the cat was afraid and bewildered. Out of fear by mistake, she uttered, what? Who can say that? What did she utter? She's a cat. Meow. Ooh, ooh, yes. <laughs> That's what she said. She said meow. That's what cats say. And then what happened? All the birds got to know that she is a cat. So they're still they're still speaking to her. Said, oh cat, if you go away then we will definitely be all right because they knew that if it's a cat, she's not going to spare them. She is going to eat them. So cat's face was all, I mean, it's, it's fell down, but yeah, cat's was, face was, cat was so disappointed uh, with shame and she walked away quietly. And that is where the story ends. I'm going to quickly read this more which the story talks about and then open the forum for everybody. A plan not properly set is destined a failure. And you would have heard, right? Um, when you plan well, the execution is easier. So planning is extremely important for any execution. All right. So the forum is open for you all kids. And I see a few kids have already raised hands. I'm gonna start picking names from here. Oh, and yeah. we'll hear what they say. Okay, yeah. So Vrinda, Bala Vrinda, you can go first. Pataji, did you call my name? I did. Okay. So, uh, uh, so Pataji, uh, we should not, we should not, um, we should not act like we are a doctor. And, and, and we know this that if we, if we are an animal, if we are an animal, so, Okay, if we are an animal, then we will uh, we will um we will do something bad. And and if we are an animal and we try to act like a um doctor, we will not able to be a doctor because cats can do meows. Every animal do moo, quack quack. They do every noise and animals can understand who are they. Yeah. And also, we should not. So the material people do this. They do. They want to. They want to. Uh, they want to make people like. They want to prank people. They want to do all these bad things. But they want to don't do like that. They just wear the normal uniform and say, "Are you sick? I can call the doctor for you." And then they can just say yes. That's what they do. They don't need to be a doctor to just help them. They can just call the doctor for them. That's what the devotees do, and see there is a difference in devotees and non-devotees. That is right. Thank you for sharing your thoughts, Balavranda. Thank right. you, Mataji. Thank you. I'm uh, moving on to Kaushiki. Kaushiki. The cat said he. The cat thought he he should kill the birds every day one by one, but he is not supposed to do that because that's bad. You should never ever kill birds. 
Because they're made from Krishna. Yeah. Thank you, oh, thank you, Kaushiki, for sharing your thoughts. All right, Sushita, you're next. You're welcome, Mataji. Please share not like what Krishna made us. We should not like her. I don't know. I don't know. That the makeup match has recently as a doctor, but the crows realize that it's a bad cat. So, the cat. But whatever we are, we are pretty, but, uh, but the cat, but like devotees, doesn't do that. But not devotees do that. Hmm. Very nice. Thank you, Sushita, for sharing your thoughts. So, Devi, you can go next. Yes, Mataji. Uh, we should not. Uh, we should not cheat. It's like we see this cat. He wanted to cheat the birds. And become a doctor, and think, and try to and uh, show that he's going to uh, treat them, but instead he'll kill them. And another lesson is that um, we should we should not open door for strangers. So uh, all the birds wanted to open the door, but this cat was a stranger. He may eat them. One bird knew. So we should not open uh, doors for strangers. Thank you, Mataji. Thank you, Zadeh. Those such lovely points. Thank you. All right. Um, Madhav, you next. We should think twice before we should think. We twice. should think I before trusting. The, twice, twice before trusting strangers. Twice for trusting two strangers. Strangers, strangers. Th strangers. Yeah, but Krishna consciousness. Is Krishna conscious devotees? Are always, trust, are always trustworthy. Is always trustworthy. Thank you, Mataji. Thank you. Thank you, Mala. Such a beautiful point. And I really like the outlook here as well. Wonderful. Thank you. Um, all right. Agarangi, you're next. Oh, and we can't be doctors because. All the devotees become a doctors because Krish, because the older birds we can't we can we can't cheat them because because they pray from Krishna and and Krishna help us praying everything when they when be devotees. Hi Krishna. Very nice. Thank you, Gorangi, for your thoughts. Thank you. Janvi? Um, uh, we should never cheat and we should never open doors for strangers. And we're when we're making plans, we should think first. That is right. Thank you for sharing your thoughts, Janvi. All right. Um, Sathvik? Mm, when making a plan, think before you do it. Thank you, Mataji. All right, thank you. Thank you for sharing that. Um, Jan Vidalai? Yes. So you, you do not open, help, you should not open your doors. If there's any stranger, pretend that I was um, I was playing and then uh, someone knocked on the door. Then I was opening and then my mom said, stop. And then my mom peeked through the hole and then she saw the stranger. So then my dad, I, I, she called her dad, my, my, my dad, and then my dad, oh, if it was a if it was a 
bully, then uh, we would pray to Krishna. That's right. Thank you, Janvi, for sharing your thoughts. Wonderful. Palvit? <clears throat> You know, do not, do not open, open door, door to strangers. To strangers. Birds, birds acted, acted smart. Smart. Thank you, Martin. Right. Yeah. Thank you, Pavit. Beautiful thoughts. Um, Shubhadra and Giridhari. Okay, Mataji, can I say it first? Actually, um, you should never fail such a thing when you really want to do something. And um, and you shouldn't believe anyone, no strangers, and you should never open doors, and you should never kill um animals and humans. Otherwise, uh, you'll get um um Okay, so actually, Mataji, like just for 10, when I was playing outside with my friend and my brother and everyone, and then I see a, a black stranger that, that's coming to my house. So then we all go in the house and then we lock the door. So we should, we should lock the door, but we should always check first until we open the door. Be cautious. That's a very, very point, dear Dari. Thank you. But this is Shubhadra. Oh, gosh. Why do I always get confused between your voices? Okay, thank you, Shubhadra. Giridhari, you want to go next? Yes, Mataji. Oops, I'm sorry. I didn't I did do that. Okay. I, I was saying that uh, we should never fail a plan because if we fail a plan, we cannot know our thoughts because if we don't know our thoughts, we cannot know or understand them. Uh, the plan uh, properly, so we should uh, always like be successful in our plans and never destined uh, failure. We cannot be a failure. Exactly. Very very. Very very devoted. All right. Thank you. Thank you for your thoughts, Atanvik. Atanvik. Mataji, so my point is that I understand from my story is that the animals can eat animal, the other animal, but humans can eat animals because because the animals, like like the last story I did last week, so so like the fox and the lion. So that story, I understand to this story. Okay. And my last point is that if you don't, if you, so there, if there's a stranger, knock the door, don't just check on, on the, on the, on the camera not open the door. That is what I understand from the story. All right, then, Mika. Thank you so much for sharing that. All right, looks like all the kids are done. All right, kids, so thank you for sharing your thoughts. Wonderful. Let's just quickly collate that before we jump into the next one. Um, yeah, you did brought up very, very good points. And as I always say, I really like when you pick up these uh, stories that are very, very material and then you tie those with Krishna consciousness. Uh, pretty good. Yeah, don't trust strangers, but you trust devotees, right? Very, very beautiful point. Um, don't kill, don't eat animals. Another beautiful point. Uh, planning. Planning is extremely important before executing anything. Um, so perfect. Good job, kids. It's so much, it's so much fun to hear you talk about the moral of any story we talk about. Uh, it's, we we talk a bit from you all the time. All right, with that, we come to the shloka. It's a shloka time, and I'm going to request Anjana Gopika Mataji to help us um, uh, revise the shloka here. Hare Krishna Mataji, over to you. Hare Krishna Mataji. 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 Hare
Thank you, Mataji. All right, kids. Are we ready for Devanagari? Get your pen and papers and let's get started. Yes, Mataji. I just need to go uh, get a list. All right. Kids. Let's do a quick recap on what we have learned so far. We can just go through real quick. Um, Jan, we go with letter K. Awesome. Tushita letter K. Thank you. Um, Torangi letter G. Ga ga gi gi gu gu gi ye bai go ga gam ga ha. Awesome, thank you. Madhav letter ga. Ga 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 ga. Ga ga gi gi gu gu gi 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 gu 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 la. Thank you, Madhav ji. Oh, thank you, Madhav. All right, Tanvik letter cha. Thank you, Tanvik. All right, so there we let her cha. Cha cha, chi chi, chu, chi chai, chu chow, cham cha. Thank you, Mataji. Awesome, thank you, Sudevi. Kaushiki, let her cha. Kaushiki. 
कौशिकी लेटर ज ज ज जी जी जु जु जे जे जय जो जम जह थैंक यू माता जी हरे कृष्णा माता जी कैन दीपक गायत्री लेटर झ Not Gayatri, but Janvi the Lai. Oh, oh, that's your mom's name. Okay, Janvi. Yeah, go ahead with letter J. Can I use some help? Yeah, of course. J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J J G, G try, G try, Jo Jao, Jo Joy, Jam Jah, Jam Jah. Mataji, can I leave? Because the the how much charge is there? It is um red. You have to charge your laptop. Yeah. Yeah, you can put the charger on and come if you want to join again. All right. Thank you, Janvi. Pavit, you want to do letter T? Yes, mother. The first T, 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 T Da da di di do 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 de die do dao dum da ha. Are you going to go with da? Yes, Master Ji. Can I go? Yes, Dari. Can go with letter da, right? Yeah, okay. Ah, yes. uh, can can I go? Uh, da, Master Ji, or da? Okay. No, uh, sorry, da. Letter da. The second one. Okay. Okay. Da. Okay. Da da di di. Do 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 date day do 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 da. Awesome, good job. Shubhadran Giridhari. Janvi, letter N. Uh, Janvi. Na na ni 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 nu 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 ne ne no no nam na. Awesome, thank you. Anybody else is interested? Two more letters left. Mataji, can I do it? Yes, Gorangi. Letter T. T T T T T T T T T I T T O T A M T A H. Awesome. The last one now. All right. So we're finishing letter T this week. It is T T T T T T T T T T T I T O T A U T A M T A H. We're picking up last four. Um, Last four combinations for today. Uh, they are first one is th with o matra is tho. In English, you can write that as t h o. Um, one of the word you can make with that is tho. Tho is nothing but bulk or wholesale kind of stuff, right? If you look at the picture, it's kind of bulk. You know, you're buying anything bulk or anywhere you see the bulk stuff. It is can it, it can be called tho. Uh, the next one is th with o matra. Is tho. Um, in English, you can write that as t h a u. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any word with that, so we're gonna skip it. Uh, the next one is tha with ang matra. Is thang, and in English, you can write that as t h a m. One of the word you can make with that is thumb. Thumb is nothing but the pole. So you see, this this is the electrical pole. So any poles like that can be called thumb. Um, The last one for today is tha with aha matra. Is tha ha? In English, you can write that as t h a h. And again, hmm, tha is not commonly used letter with these kind of combinations. So I couldn't find a word with that as well. So I just found two, and that's what we have. Let's quickly go to the whiteboard and start writing these last four letters of the day. 
I'm going to share the whiteboard real quick. All right, let's do this. All right, so our letters for today is to, tau, tam, and taha, right? Uh, everything starts with uh, writing this letter. So, you know, this is how you write this, ta, and then you make a vertical line that and a horizontal line, horizontal line like this. Uh, the first one is to. Th plus O matra. For O matra, you make another vertical line just adjacent to the first vertical line. And Tho is just one matra on the top like this. This is your letter Tho. Now Tho. Tho is exactly the same as this. The only change is two matras on the top. So let's start writing that as well. So this is your letter Th, one matra, um, one vertical line here. Second vertical line right here. There is a horizontal line which joins them together. And then um, yeah, right, sorry. Uh, so for Tau Matra, the two vertical lines on the top, that's your Tau Matra. The third one is Taha. Again, let's write the letter Tha. So this is your letter Tha again, exact same way we're writing. Thang is Tha and one dot on the top. Ang Matra on the top, that's it, Taha, uh, Thang. The last one is Taha. Th is nothing, but again, we're going to write the same th letter right here with all the lines. The only change we're going to make is <clears throat> these two dots here, colon kind of dots, and that makes your th. So tho, thau, thang, and th. Four letters for today. And I'm ready for anyone who wants to share the screen with me. Okay, looks like um, Brenda is ready. Okay, um, Brenda, were you showing? Mataji, this is Janvi. I'm done. Yeah, bring it closer. Um, bring it slightly more closer, Janvi. All right, good. Thank you, Janvi. Good job. All right, uh, Satvik, ready for you as well. I cannot see Satvik. Um, I can only see your hands. Okay, yeah. Mataji, can I show mine, Mataji? Yeah, I'll come to you with Satvik on. Okay. Um, who is showing Tanvik? Are you showing? Yeah. Bring it closer, Tanvik. Um, Mataji, can you give me the PPT, please? Yeah. You know my letters for today. Oh. Uh, yeah, Tanvik. Uh, Tanvik, just one change, which I always repeat that when you do the matras, draw the matras on the second vertical line. Or if there is just one vertical line, draw on that. Otherwise, the second vertical line. The matras has to touch that, but otherwise, everything looks so good. Very beautiful. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Anybody else is ready? And Shubhadra Shah. Yeah, go ahead, Shubhadra. This is actually my clipboard. And so I got it to All right. Oh, wow. Lovely letter, Shubhadra. Uh, do, you, do, I see, do I see two vertical lines in Thang, the third letter? There is only one vertical line there. Oh. Uh. Yeah, so just erase I, that. I thought, there was the, I thought there was two in each of the letters. No, tongue and tongue has only one vertical line. Is it better now, Mataji? Yep, they look beautiful. Beautiful letters, though. Beautiful handwriting. Thank you, Mataji. Sure. Mataji, can I show my uh, letters? Yes, so baby. Yeah, I'm ready for you. All right, beautiful, lovely. 
Good job, Sudevi. Anybody else is ready? Yes, Mataji, it's Kushita. Yeah, Sushita, I'm ready for you too. And then Kaushiki, I'll come to you next. All right, Tushita, let's see. All right. Oh, those are cute letters, Tushita. So I think we have something missing here. On the last letter, you need the colons, right? The two dots. I think that's missing. Or Mataji? I can't Mataji, I, I have two dots. Yeah. You have two dots? OK. Yeah. Because Mataji? I think I can't see it from here. But if you have two dots uh, on the last letter, then you are good. The rest of the letters look perfect. Beautiful letters. Mataji? Thank you. Yes, yes, Giridhari. Uh, can we can we go in the uh, can we go in the uh, a whiteboard because my brother needs to see it. Okay, here yeah, whiteboard. Yes, Kashuki, I'm ready for you. Kushita, well done. Kashuki. Pashiki, I cannot see um, if you have written anything. Yeah, okay. All right. Uh, for Thau, the second letter, you need another vertical line, uh, Kashiki. Otherwise, the rest everything looks good, okay? Okay. You just need a little bit of practice. That's it. All right, kids, it's time to wrap up now. Um, <laughs> Uh, Mataji, can my brother show? Yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, Mataji, it's the turn to show. Kids, it's... All right, yeah, Hare Krishna, Shila Prabhupada, Thank you, Mataji. Thank you, Hare Krishna. Thank you, Krishna. Thank you, Krishna. Thank you, Krishna. Thank you, Krishna. So now we will move to the Tamod, uh, sorry, Covid class. We'll stop the line.